Hello everyone. My name is Abhishek and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be very short but very very informative. So make sure you watch this video till the end. A lot of people are learning devops through our courses or from some other sources but when it comes to attending the interviews or actually working as a devops engineer many people are not confident to be honest same thing happened with me as well back then when i was a java developer and when i started learning devops and cloud with my personal interest i started with scripting then i learned ansible then i learned python kubernetes but nothing was falling into places i was not confident about giving the interviews or i was not at all confident about devops although i learned a lot of concepts so in this video i will share two things that helped me and i believe that is also going to help you so the first thing that helped me of course many of you might know structural learning so learning things in structure starting with linux then going to shell scripting version control system everything that i have put in my playlist so you all know we have a date playlist devops aws or azure terraform and python all the courses are available in the course system you can go they are all structured and you can learn the things but second thing is very important that is understanding of software development life cycle this is a crucial thing and when i learned how devops fits into the sdlc that changed my perspective of devops then things started becoming easy i learned version control system i learned git i learned the git commands but i did not knew how devops engineer use these commands or how devops engineers use the concept of version control system and why when i learned the role of devops in the software development life cycle and how devops accelerates the sdlc that is when i learned that okay so these things are used in the build process and by using these things in the build process i can build the application and that would somehow help in accelerating the sdlc similarly i learned kubernetes but i really did not understand why and what devops engineer does with kubernetes again software development life cycle and understanding help me so i recommend people spending some time understanding software development life cycle you don't need to understand writing an application or you don't need to actually develop an application but at least understand the phases what is the planning phase what is requirement gathering what is the build phase development phase deployment phase monitoring phase and how they are all connected finally how devops accelerates the software development life cycle that is the reason when i started my free devops course the very second video the first video is introduction to devops and immediate second video is how devops fits into software development life cycle from my learnings i put that as second video on the channel so that everybody is clear why they are learning devops of course i couldn't cover everything in that 40 minutes video but i try to put the important thing so that you get the gist of what you are learning in the video links in the description i will add few more links of software development life cycle and devops connection with software development life cycle so if you want the first step go to the video the second video in the complete devops course again that link will also be in the description after that you can read few other links that i'm going to put in the description so this is something that i wanted to share and i want 
all of my subscribers to at least spend some time and do this important thing trust me after that once you understand why are you doing things the way you do the things will improve significantly same is with devops as well so that's the video for today thank you so much for watching today's video see you all in the next one take care bye bye